Yo quiero hoy dar la cara por, uh, porque esta derrota para mí es mía. Uh, lo tengo que asumir. Uh, estoy triste por mis compañeros, por uh, el esfuerzo que han hecho y tengo mi, mi responsabilidad en esta derrota. Así que, bueno, yo creo que estábamos bien en el partido, lo habíamos preparado bien. Y bueno, lo había dicho antes, los errores se pagan muy, muy caro a ese nivel. Hoy no, no tengo explicaciones en, en estos errores. Esto, esto pasa en el fútbol, lo tengo que, que asumir, es una noche complicada para mí. Y bueno, en lo bueno como en lo malo tengo que asumir um, mi error, mi, mi papel y nada, yo creo que... No hay que, que pensárselo más, yo creo que lo, que lo que hemos hecho es darlo todo en el campo y a veces puedes fallar, hoy he fallado y lo tengo que, que asumir. Estoy, como les he dicho, triste por mis compañeros, yo creo que, claro, uh, agradezco el apoyo de mis compañeros y bueno, esto no me ha pasado muchas veces en mi carrera. Eh, nada, yo creo que esto, esto pasa, esto, esto, bueno, hay errores en todo el campo, pero hay algunas zonas en el campo donde se, se paga muy caro. Y bueno, es así. Yo creo que todos saben que estoy triste, que, que lo tengo que asumir. Y nada, hay que, que tener carácter para, para volver mejor y más fuerte. Y es lo, ya pienso en eso. Y nada, va a ser una noche complicada, eso es normal. Soy un competidor y hemos, hemos perdido y he fallado, así que no me voy contento, eso está claro y nada, yo tengo que, que asumirlo, como lo he dicho. Gracias, Rafa. Bueno, no podemos, no podemos estar contentos, obvio, porque, porque perdemos un partido, perdemos una, una clasificación, pero al final eh, lo que hicimos toda la temporada es que estamos orgullosos de, de eso. Eh, esto es el fútbol, eh, perdemos dos partidos contra un rival también. Bueno, y, y a veces hay que aceptar, hemos tenido nuestras nuestro oportunidades de, 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 de marcar y nos ha faltado un poco, un poco bueno, eh, sobre todo la segunda parte de cuando nosotros estuvimos mejor. Eh, pero al final este es el fútbol, eh, no hay que, no hay que, 95% de lo que hicimos toda la temporada ha sido excelente. Eh, bueno, hoy jugamos también contra un rival. E é que é que se está. Ferir o adversário. Onde há espaço? Grande intervenção de Ederson. A Córdoba Real tenta reentrar nas contas do apuramento para a final da 8 de Lisboa. É de nada. Com mais pressão, mais rotação, a equipa do Real a querer definitivamente IVA da equipa. Mais do que preventiva, uma equipa que reage muito bem. Com parte do adversário. Sim, muito moldável. É uma equipa. Passa para Tony Cross, que já se juntava na companhia de Casemiro. Para o início. City já não pressiona tão em cima. Até espera que um jogador do Real se adiante para pressionar. E depois já... João Cancelo arranca o português. Tentativa de colocar na diagonal. Meren. Que belo pormenor de Rodrigo. Ganhou a linha de cabeceira. Cruzou o cabeceamento para dentro. O jogo no Betiade. E agora, agora está tudo relançado. Quando nada o fazia prever. Consegue acordar em definitivo da letargia. A equipa do Real marca... O homem do costume, o suspeito do costume, porque é apenas para Karim Benzema. Cá está, Sr. Benzema. Vamos às contas. 1 um a 1 um no placar, 3 a 2 no conjunto da eliminatória para o Manchester City. Atenção à equipa do City. Carrega também em Finally poised. Although at the moment, from a tactical standpoint, it's hard. A throw in here. The trophy that's eluded Guardiola as the Manchester City boss. Past Hazard, he has to do better than that. Casemiro was back there again. Oh, yes, yeah, he was. Mirrors to the ball. England, been in excellent form. Made some crucial. Sterling up against Mendy. He's a good player. Nice little battle actually between them here. There's De Bruyne. Looking to uh, change the complexion of it for Manchester City and then Carvajal was hoping that Courtois was going to come in. It's Hazard looking for Mendy and Benzema's coming in in the middle. And it was good defending in there for City by Laporte. It's the first...
Jesus. And uh, Danny Carver held it well over there, the Real Madrid. It's a nice run by Rodrigo. Pass wasn't great by Danny Carver. It's on Monday at 11 o'clock on 1HD. He's Foden with a shot. And that was inches wide. Uh, it was Real Madrid again. So no, one, realized. no one ever fancies taking on Carl Walker. For it's a chance for Benzema. Oh, he's, the flag went up. I don't think it would have counted. No. But again, he'd managed to find a bit of space inside the Manchester City box, which will... Really some excellent football being played down there by some very, very good players. Forward here for the City corner. that's fizzed in. And was well watched. Central area, don't they? When the hoops there and looked up, there was nothing in no height. Finals of the Champions League. We're all square at half-time. It's one all on the... 2-1 for that, of course. That's the only way that um, extra time can happen. Manchester as forwards. But Real Madrid, if they need the goals like this he's in behind him again and it's good for sterling always wasted it went with the left foot gabriel jesus was an option in the middle but he got goal side easily there of danny carver the real madrid penalty area again it's de bruyne he must have seen something steve yeah. that's the second time he's gone for courtois near but he needs to get on the ball more if he's going to be the talisman the match win so it's not something they can in the middle Kyle Walker's gone steaming past him. And Militao has looked nervous throughout back there, Steve, I think. He got away with it. When I think this is more natural for them. Rodrigo ran into Cancelo. I think he expected Felix. And Tony Cross with a bit of room. And at the City captain. This is good for Manchester City, here's Gundogan, and then here's Sterling. On the left-hand side, Hazard's gone through the middle, Benzema still, and he saw the goal and saw the gap, and decided to take the shot himself. Can't go for the near post <laughs> on this side, De Bruyne. Well. Kyle Walker to Kevin De Bruyne, here's De Bruyne. Good skill by De Bruyne, and a good challenge in the end by Danny Carvajal. Yeah. He was twisting and turning against Eder Militao, but Danny Carvajal came off. And Sergio Ramos on Gabriel Jesus in Madrid. In yeah, I think it's ideal time for Real Madrid to make. The real contrast is that one of them... Here's Kevin De Bruyne, drilling one through. And uh, Gundogan couldn't quite get there quickly enough to tap into what would have been us. Pressure here now because Benzema's got it and still has it and shoots. And it was a vital block there by uh, Imeric Laporte. And he gives it to Benzema. And Benzema shoots and Edison's in the right place for uh, Manchester City. In front, Gundogan with a touch. Lovely turn by Jesus. Vital save by Courtois. It's a brilliant save. Excellent football by Manchester City. Yeah, Manchester City cutting Real Madrid open again. Lovely. Moran just had to get moving a little bit quicker there with uh, Jesus coming across for Manchester. And he hasn't scored in the Champions League so far this season, but he's to do the same going the other way. And it's not the strongest of headers. Oh, it's a brilliant finish. It's an absolutely outstanding instinctive finish by Gabriel Jesus after yet another mistake by Rafa Varane. Excellently taken, and what an important goal that could be for Manchester City. Yeah, an incredible part of this evening. As you rightly said, he can't believe it. Sergio Ramos, but what a finish. Modric coming in with the shot, and somehow City managed. Carvajal with the ball, Cancelo with a touch. City, it's Bernardo Silva. Kevin De Bruyne is waiting. Bernardo Silva didn't want to give him the ball. Could have given it to De Bruyne, could have slipped Sterling back in, could have done it. Here's Cancelo, 